doing? I thought I'd use this vlog as a little bit of a catch up, um, tell you what is coming up in the world of Parry Ray. Um, the first thing I want to tell you is in the next few weeks, we should be filming our new video. So I'm really excited about that. Um, and I think the next single is gonna be White Wedding from my album, Know The Way Back. I don't know if you've checked it out. It's really a very different take on the Billy Idol classic. We're ironing out locations and storylines and things like that. But I have the main task of trying to find wardrobe choices. So I'm thinking something white, but obviously we don't want to be too literal. Um, if you saw some of the photos we did recreating the original 80s singles for my album, um, you would have seen me in a white ball dress on the cover of the White Wedding um, Parry Ray kind of single. That dress is beautiful and I've had it for seven, eight years. So I don't know, who needs an excuse to find a new outfit? But I'm thinking maybe something a little, um, little shorter or a little more modern or something that gives a nod to a wedding but not, as I say, too literal. Um, so I wanna show you some things. Here's the first dress I want to show you. It's from Couples. Um, I have to tell you, I went into my local Couples and tried this dress on. Um, and whilst it is really, really lovely, um, it really just doesn't suit my body shape. The waist doesn't kind of fall in the right place and it's kind of oddly boxy and drapey. And I think if you were tall and had more of an athletic figure, I think um, that would work really well. Anyway, it's a really lovely dress and I think it would work for the video, but it doesn't really suit me at all. Here is the second dress from Outnet. This is actually a night dress. I know, am I crazy? However, slip dresses and night dresses are really in so let me just show you, that's the back. How beautiful is the back? So this could be a contender. Um, I've got a feeling I might have to take it up by a couple of inches because I'm shorter than this lovely model. So that might work. Um, it just depends on, I guess, the storyline and where we are. That okay, back to vlogging. Um, so that is um, costumes and upcoming video. The other thing, I um, wanted to tell you about is I was sent these lovely products. Christophe Robin, he's Parisian I think, it's a Parisian company and I have just washed my hair because it's actually wet underneath with the delicate volumizing shampoo with rose extracts and volumizing conditioner with rose extracts and this is what I can tell you. Um, the shampoo cleans really nicely and you don't feel like you've got residue in your hair. Um, the conditioner, I think, is quite gentle, and I have quite a lot of hair, and I think this is for fine hair. So my hair's a little bit thicker and coarser, so maybe I should have put a little bit more in or left it in for a bit longer. Anyway, it conditions really nicely, but it's a light condition. When you come out and you you kind of towel dry your hair, it really smells of rose. But not in an overpowering, unnatural way, because I think it's, uh, it's the natural rose extract. If you like rose, and I do, it's lovely. And when you dry your hair, the um, fragrance kind of dilutes. Um, so now, now I'm smelling my hair. It's, um, yeah, it's really faint, but it's nice, and it kind of smells clean. And what I would say, is it's delicate but volumizing. So I did my thing that I do with my hair, which is I rough dry it, do that, and then tie it up, and then leave it for about 10, 15 minutes and let it down and it kind of does its thing. So I don't think it's looking flat. I think it's looking quite um, volumized. Um, so big thumbs up, I think, to Christoph Robin. I also have been very kindly sent by my friends at Nessa Porter um, the regenerating shampoo and conditioner. So I will try that and um, I'll let you know how I get on. So, Ramble Tastic Parry vlog. I'm really 
loving the interaction with you guys um, and the positive feedback I'm getting for the album. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm loving also the fact that some people are reaching out and telling me they like my ramblings on fashion and have actually gone out and bought outfits for weddings and special occasions, having read something I've written or something I've posted. So that's great. Um, if there's something you want to know about me or about the things I'm interested in, give me a shout and I might do a blog on a particular subject or do a vlog. But I have to say thank you so much for all your support. So I think that's about it. I will catch up with you soon and yeah, I hope you're having a lovely time whatever you're doing.